Yo guys I am back with another video. Today I am going to be giving you guys some more tips and tricks on how to get better, call this a part 2. I am going to be teaching certain techniques in which you can use and practice with to get better. I will be teaching these techniques step by step, and then I will show you guys what things you should practice on to make your game look something like this. That boy is Benny Hanna. Okay so my first tip is practice your tracking with a friend or you can just do it in a real time game, but I recommend with a friend. As you may know there are no custom servers so just go on to a different region with fewer to no players. Tip is predictive fire. This is having your crosshair ready on places in which people could peek from so that if they do pick you can be ready to shoot and most likely kill them first. Here is a practice you can do, get your friend to stand behind a blind spot and you should go around telling him you coming over so you are both expecting each other. Then just keep repeating this, by doing this you will notice your reaction time slowly going up. Here is an example. Another thing you could do to practice predictive fire with a friend is by practicing this more realistic scenario. This time I will run through this arch and see my friend running behind the wall. I will then go through the other entrance predicting he is running towards there and then predictive fire and hopefully kill him. Right so my third tip, you could say most important, is movement. You need to always be moving, while you're aiming, while you're not aiming, while you're not fighting, but you should also always be constantly rolling, jumping and sliding. This is because when you start doing this, straight away you will become a harder target for everyone. Also a little tip for you guys is that if you want to slide just hold the roll button. Here is a quick clip of me in this I almost got killed by the person on top of the building, if I wasn't rolling I would have died. This next tip is about landing your headshots. Landing headshots will allow you to kill your opponent swiftly and so you will most likely get kill streaks a lot more often if you can always hit the head. Here is a clip if headshot kills versus normal kills. So as you can see the headshots killed my enemies within a half to a second quicker than the body shots, and I know you guys may think that it's nothing but trust me those headshots are vital to you killing everyone you come up against. Now the last thing is. Settings. 
These really should be your own custom ones because we all play on different devices so we will all need more or less sensitivity depending on the size of the device. But I will show my settings anyways. Otherwise that is the end of the video. I hope these tips helped and you enjoyed the video, like and sub or I'll do something. Peace out.